here in Fort Collins, Colorado, doing something a little bit different today. I'm gonna be out selling wine. Uh, you know, this business we started 10 years ago, and I always like getting out from time to time and meeting new people and seeing these accounts. So it's kind of a, you know, the real kind of grassroots, you know, sales building stuff where, you know, get in a car with a wrap, retail, restaurants. I like doing this kind of stuff, building my community around um, sales has such a great uh, effect on the other businesses. You know, like a day like today, I could be in a retailer in Fort Collins and um, they may have never even heard of Low Collins. While this is a kind of a real hustle and bustle kind of sales day for selling wine, it always opens so many new doors uh, and builds uh, our other brands um, and allows us to tell our story, which at the end of the day is how you build brands. One guest at a time, one person at a time, one story at a time, doing it over and over and over again. Two days, but still. <laughs> Affordable before actually we're actually moving this wood to old, moving this wine to old wood starting in 15. The wine hasn't come out yet. Because wine has been so good, yep. and because we're slowly like getting the you know like yep. the, the wood bridges out of right. there and like some of this other like stuff out of the fridge and putting the new stuff in and the new people over here are grabbing yes. the new stuff. Yes. We want to keep it stocked. Good. So I mean I love it all. You know those little accounts and think. You know, not much business to be done here. And the truth is, is that there's tons of business to be done there. Most people just don't care about those guys. And I think that as someone who is grinding every day, like whether it's building PL, when you put in that, that you know, real, real work to try to build the blocks one by one, you understand where a guy like that's coming from. And so getting, getting that guy the pricing that where he can really make something of these wines. He loves them, they're affordable. He knows people are gonna care about them. He knows they over deliver for the price. So just making a deal with him where it can work for him too. And I think people forget that. They think about like, oh, what's gonna work for us the best versus what's gonna work for him the best. And then eventually it's gonna work for you the best as opposed to trying to make it work for the best for you from the beginning. Building brands is really just about putting in the time to care for each individual connection you make, each individual buyer in this case of today and telling the story. Whether you're telling the wine story, you're connecting to your restaurant pass, you're connecting to new opportunities or new things you're doing. The real tether here to any, to any business, the secret to success in business is communication. Uh, that's how you run a well-oiled machine restaurant, that's how you run a well-oiled machine law firm, um, uh, how you run a well-oiled machine wine business. Communication, your top, top people, gotta be all on the same page and disseminate the information 